Night Football trying to do what no Class A program in the state of Nebraska has done in 35 years. That's win three straight Class A state titles. And this after one of the most dominant seasons ever, the Warriors return to the practice field. Matt Satilli now has more from Westside High. Energy and excitement. That's what Westside head football coach Paul Lamangi said he saw from his team at an early morning practice in an afternoon walkthrough as the Warriors returned to the gridiron after back-to-back -back Class A state championships. Warriors on three, one, two, three. Warriors, Warriors, Warriors. It's a new journey. It's a new team. Um, you know, we had really uh, some special years uh, the last couple, and uh, you know, we, we celebrated that. Now it's time to move on. The good thing, we don't have to play last year's team. You always have goals at the start of the season, you know, and you just want to max out. You want to be the best team you can be every year. You know, you want to play your best game as your last game. Despite losing talented seniors on both sides of the ball, there's plenty to be excited about with this year's squad, including the top high school recruit in the state, senior linebacker Christian Jones. We have to be relentless. Last year we had amazing seniors, you know, Teddy, Anthony. They showed me how to do it and I'm, I'm trying to mimic them in many ways, you know, just lead by example and do everything the right way. And with Anthony Rezac off to Notre Dame, sophomore Braylon Warren will step in at quarterback. He's doing everything right so far. We think he's going to be a heck of a leader, and uh, I think Anthony Rezac really helped him out last offseason on how to become a great leader. If he picked up um, even a little bit of what Anthony had, I think we'll be in good shape, but but we're excited to have him. He, he will be the general. Westside can become the first team to win three consecutive Class A state titles since Creighton Prep won five in a row from 1985 to 1989. Reporting at Westside High School, Matt Satilli, KETV News Watch 7 Sports.